Hey, I'm with Martin Fisk at Men's Link, and I'm here... Um, G'day, Marty. G'day, mate. I just want to have a chat to you about Buddy Franklin, and it's been extraordinary what's gone on in the last couple of days, and I think it's really positive. What do you think? I think it's fantastic that we're seeing more and more high-profile people who are under stress, who do have high-profile, high-pressure jobs or careers or things like that, saying, do you know what? This is really stressful. I need to take some time out. Mm. And they're not doing it by themselves. They're getting help from their club. They're getting help from professionals. They're getting help from mates. And it's fantastic to see the turnaround from when you and I were younger, where an admission of a mental health problem mm. was pretty much akin to a, a career-ending moment. Oh, very much so. We've got, a foot, we've got a football final coming up exactly. in Perth on Sunday. And, and Buddy Franklin is a key player. And the club is saying, look, his health and well-being is much more important than this football team. And that's pretty cool. And I think that's fantastic. I mean, here at Men's Link, we work with the Brumbies, the Raiders, Cricket ACT, and we've got lots of experience talking to the coaching staff, the management and the players. And all three of those clubs, and I'm certain that extends to AFL and hockey and netball and basketball and all the other sports, the clubs think mental health is important it is acceptable to have problems. And these guys are investing a lot of money and resources into player wellbeing. And I'm not just talking player wellbeing on the field, I'm talking as people. And it's just a wonderful thing to see. And maybe, maybe over time, we're really going to turn around these issues we have with suicide rates and you know horrendous sort of behaviour which often can be linked back to poor mental health outcomes. And I think having players feel supported both on the field, but more importantly, off the field and supported as human beings, not just as somebody who can kick a footy, but actually as a human being, I, I think that's a wonderful thing. And, um, you know, congratulations to the Sydney Swans, congratulations to the AFL and all of the sporting codes. Well done.